Hey, how's it going? So I have another unboxing. It's been quite some time since we checked out Peak Fingerboards. Well, it's about time to return to the Peak. Let's check it out. What is this bag made out of? Industrial strength bubble mailer. So we did get a note. It says, thanks man. I hope you enjoy the decks. Peak fingerboards. Super cool. I'll stick you right there. So inside the bag there was one sticker. And it's this really cool peak sticker. It says peak. And it has two mountains. That's super cool. I haven't seen this sticker before. So this go around I did get three decks. I wanted to try. So the last time we visited peak. I had got a couple of these decks, the Nose Go decks, and I got the, what was it, the, I did get the Valley Concave, which is going to be the Medium Concave, and since then, my preference has changed, I still do like the Popsicle, 34 millimeters. however, this go around, we are going to try the Mountain Concave, which is going to be the Deeper Concave, because for the last few months that's pretty much what i've stuck to is the deeper concave so the first deck i'm going to show is called the circle split this one is blue i think there was like eight or nine different colors there's a whole bunch of different colors to choose from on this one this very reflective deck right here is going to be the three year birthday hollow deck and i thought it looked really cool on the picture it looks even cooler in person so there's a whole bunch of like it's so there's the black lines that you can see but in between those lines there's like a bunch of different colors and they're all swirling right behind it that looks really really cool and here's the third deck so this one is kind of a little bit different so there's a graphic underneath the silver i guess we'll get into it because this is the deck that i do want to try out so with the silver one being very reflective I'm just going to show the packaging with this one so if you haven't ordered from peak before this is what the packaging looks like on the top does have peak fingerboards, says the shape right there, as well as the size and the concave, which is going to be right here. So on the inside does have this peak repeat going on right here as and all of the social media pages right there. So inside the bag, there was one more of those vinyls and then one sheet of what is called the summit tape, I believe is what it's called. And of course, the deck. So here's the deck. Again, it's like a mirror. That's really cool. So we won't spend too much time on that. But here's the top ply. So lucky me, it came in this really nice purple. We do have peak engraved right there in the middle. The middle plies look like it's going to be a dark green. So on the top right here, it does say the size of the deck. So this is going to be 98 millimeters long. Down here, it says MT for the mountain concave, which is going to be the deep concave. And it does say 34 right there so something that's really cool is the graphic isn't a mirror it's kind of a foiling that's over the graphic so these decks came out on pokemon day and there was different pokemon that you could get who i got will be a surprise for now you have to sesh it to reveal it i mean obviously i know who i got because i i picked it out here's the bits and pieces that we're putting on it so we got some purple wheels purple bushings, red pivot cups, because I do not have purple pivot cups. So that is the only hint that you'll get for now. But I am excited to try this deck out. So here's the deck, all set up. Got the purple poisons from Labs. The deck, of course, is going to be a peak fingerboard, mountain concave, 34 millimeter popsicle, and the grip tape. This time I went with the FBS because the last one that I've been using, that one had black velvet, so I thought, yeah, let's switch it up a little bit. Can't wait to see uh, the Pokemon when it comes out. It's going to be a lot of kick clip front side board slides. If I could land them. That's going to sound a little bit rougher than uh, than that rail. Dude, 
So apparently only time will tell. Uh, the spoiling is on here pretty, pretty good. So my initial thoughts on the mountain concave, on the pictures it looked like it was gonna be a giant, giant change from the valley that I've been using. It's not, it's like a very comfortable um, increase, I guess is the best way to put it. So if you like the deeper concave, but not like ridiculously, comically deep, try out the mountain. It's very, very solid. And if you just wanna try a different fingerboard, Go try a peak fingerboard. What I really like about these ones is the nose and the tail is almost symmetrical. The nose does go up just a tiny bit higher than the tail does. But if you can see like how fat the kicks are or how fat the nose and the tail is, it is so comfortable to ride. I meant to grind on the thingy. So this was my most recent order from Peak, and yeah, it's been a while since I got something from Peak, but believe me when I tell you, I had a lot of decks to go through with Peak. At some point, we'll see what Pokemon this is under here. I, like I said, I know who it is, and the purple wheels, purple bushings, purple top play, that should be a good hint at um who it is. So this fingerboard right here, the peak fingerboard, is going to be player three that's coming with me to booze. If you want to grab one of these Pokemon Day decks, Birthday Hollow, these split plies, there's another, there's a few other split plies that were on the website. I'll have the link to that website down in the description below, as well as his Instagram. That way you can stay up to date with whatever he has going on. And I'll have my Instagram down there too. Give me a follow. I do go live from time to time, usually later on in the evenings, during the weekends. However, that'll do it for this video. Take it easy. Have a good one.